In this video, we're going to learn how to make the 10 inch chain link cables square. The cables appear to link together just like you would see on a chain link fence. What we're going to need to make this square is about two and a half ounces of medium worsted weight yarn, a size I, nine, or five and a half millimeter crochet hook, or in US terminology, and there are a couple special stitches, which is a front post double crochet and a front post treble crochet. And the stitch repeat, if you want to make this bigger, is a multiple of 16 plus 5. All even rows are single crochet rows and you skip the stitches behind the post stitches. So if you skip the stitches behind the post stitches you'll see there's these little ridges that are left behind on the back of the work. So what we're going to do is get started. We're going to chain 37 and I'm going to zoom in here a little bit. I'll leave a little bit of a tail so you can draw it in later. And I'm going to go ahead and chain 37 and I will see you at the end of the chain. All right, we have 37 chains and now we're going to single crochet for row one, single crochet in the second chain from the hook and each chain across the row. I am going to work into the back bump of the chain. This is not crucial for this pattern. Um, it ju I just like the finished look of the edge. That's the way the edge looks when you do the back bump of the chain. It gives it just a nice little finished look. But that's what I'm doing. So I'm going to single crochet in each across and I'll see you at the other end. All right, we've finished row one. Now we're going to start row two. And all the even rows are the same as row two, which is you chain one during your work and you single crochet in each stitch across. So no matter what the stitch is, whether it's single crochet, um, front post double or front post treble, you single crochet in each of those stitches. I'm going to end this video here and we will do row three in a different video. So I will see you there.